Hello everyone, I am Shahid Musafirin and today I am going to show you MPC view model and partial view and let's get started without any further delay. What I am going to do is, I am going to create two models. Our first model will be game. game and add some properties in that I'm gonna create one property called name and add another property called type means the type of that game I'm gonna save this model let's add another prop another model called Player and add properties in that. I'm gonna create a property called player name. I'm gonna save this model. Let's back, let's get back to the home controller and create an action called public. Game profile. I'm giving this action name as game profile and return view from the action. Basically, we can't return two views in one view. So for that, I'm gonna create in a, a folder called view model in our solution explorer. We have already created this folder in our solution explorer so let's open this and add properties in that for player player get set add another property for the game class and Creating a list of games, okay. Get save this view model and let's get back to the home controller where we have created our action. Let's access this view model in our action grab player equals to new player and add player name equals to sha sha army okay and create another object for the game name equals to FIFA Type of the game equals to football. So these two views we have to return in this view. In this view, on this we have already created our view model called home view home file view model so let's access that home profile view model equals to new home profile view model let's add player and assign the player Games 
equals to this k Oh, we have created a list of the game here and we are trying to return a single object. So let's create a list here. Game equals to new. List of game game name equals to FIFA type of a game. Uh, GTA and the type of the game I'm giving it as chasing game you can give any name it's your wish put semicolon here now you can see it is taking that list variable in the games because we have created a list of that game of that class game class you can see is taking now so let's return this view model in our view for hp vm home profile view model and now i'm gonna create a view for game profile Okay, in our home folder, is going to be here. Yeah, I'm gonna create one view for it. Let's take a new item, and this is view page, and give the exact name as we had here. Game profile. Okay. Yeah, I got it now. Let's give view back dot title equals to games and okay games. Let's take it as games. I'm gonna add h1 tag here and I'm gonna give name. Player name. Okay. Let's get back to this. Player name. I'm gonna add model. Post ASP code. And our solution name dot models dot let's take it as models it's not showing let's do it again model post ASP code dot models dot sorry I have to take view model form profile view model okay add model dot layer this will 
show the player name because in our home profile view model we have taken it this player and we are assigning a player name from the action okay and description about the game description or the game description okay and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a partial view for this game description and I have already created the partial view here avoid this session I have created a table called I have created a table for this game description you can see here table row game and type in that table row uh, in the another row I'm gonna try I'm gonna show you how we can access the game name and the type of the game description is not there we have type I'm gonna include the partial view here. Partial give the partial view name called game partial. So we are done. We have created our partial view here. You can see I am trying to access the name of the game and the type of the game. And I am here. I am gonna show you the name and the type of the game in the for each loop. Here we have the for each loop for the name, game of the name, and the type the game is here so we are done now just we need to run this application save it and let's run this application now it might take some time application is running now you can see all good let's give our controller name and our action name here our action name is game profile game profile yeah we can see here first is before that models are players Let's delete this H1 row. Yeah, we can see game description, the type of the game, and game name in a table format from this partial view. Yeah, now it looks pretty good. The game description is showing the particular table which we have created in our partial view the game and the type yeah you can see here 
so that's all about the view model and the partial view thank you so much guys and don't forget to like this uh, video thank you so much